Hi, my name is Brian Kane, and I am a small business solution advisor with the Microsoft Connections team. Today, I'm going to show you how to set up a site using Office Live, a software as a service solution provided by Microsoft. Software as a service is a tremendous solution because it enables you to leverage the full power of applications directly from your web browser without any large local installations on your machine or without any updates to install. Today, we are going to be focusing on Microsoft Office Live for Small Business which is a software as a service application that allows you to go through the entire process of creating a website directly from your web browser. And in the case of Office Live for Small Business Basics, completely for free. Again, all we have to do is click Sign Up Free under Office Live Small Business. We will then select which type of Office Live for Small Business site we want to create. We can choose from Basics, Essentials, and Premium. Over the upcoming webcast, we will cover features in each. However, for today, let's sign up for an Office Live basic site, which once again is completely free. The first step is to choose your company's domain name. It's important to note that this will be a domain name of your choice. It will not be yourcompany.microsoft.com. In this case, I would like to make a website about learning Office Live and all of the incredible features within it. I've chosen my domain name and now I can see that it is available. I'll confirm my choice and then proceed to enter information about my account. I can go ahead and add in other accounts later. When you enter in your password, try to make sure it's as secure as possible. The longer the better and the more uppercase, lowercase, special characters and numbers you use, the better. Once you've completed entering some of the personal and contact information, a credit card will be required simply to verify your identity to help Microsoft fight against fraud. Once you've entered in your credit card information, you can then tell us a little more information about your business. We will enter the name of our business, the closest category to our business, as well as the size of our business. Finally, we will agree to the disclosure terms, as well as the service agreement. Then we are ready to complete our site. We've now gone through and set up a site completely for free using Office Live for Small Business Basics. In the next webcast, we will add users configure email accounts, and begin making changes to our website. And for more great webcasts, audiocast, resources, and information about live events in your area, please visit microsoft.com connections.